Welcome race fans to the 2021 Fruit Belt Cub Car Rally. Joining us today are First North Grimsby Pack A&B, First Vineland, and First Beamsville. Today we have a fun-filled day of racing 40 Cub Cars, 24 Beaver Buggies, and a slew of beautifully made uh, Scout Trucks. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm getting word, hold on one, one minute folks, I'm getting word from our trackside attendant Bubbles. Uh, he's got some news trackside. Hi folks, I'm here trackside at Quarry Ridge Speedway. Conditions couldn't be more perfect. We have a bone dry, dusty environment that should lead to some high speed cup car beaver, beaver buggy racing. Back to you in studio, Bubbles. For the 24 beaver buggies, we will be racing five races each buggy. After five races, we will be cutting it down to the top 20. And after that, we will be going into a finals to determine the winner of the Beaver Buggy Trophy. We also have two best in shows for the Beaver Buggy class. 40 Cub Cars will be competing for the Cub Car Trophy. We also have three other trophies for best Cub Car built, the best design and the best paint job. All were chosen by a third party, non-partisan. Cub Cars will run 10 races each down the track Point system awarded, one point for winning, two points for second place, and three points for third. Uh, lowest score added on, top 21 cars will be moving on to the finals. And after that, we will be racing five races per, per Cub car. Points are done the exact same way. One point for first, two points for second, three points for third. From those top 21, 22 cars, all depends on what the point systems are, we will be, we will be picking four cars to make it to the finals. After, the, after that, it is a heads up, winner take all for the big, big Cub Car Rally Trophy. Introducing the Beaver Buggies. The first Beamsville Cub Cars. The first Vineland Cub Cars. The first North Grimsby Cub Cars. The amazing scout trucks. Let the races begin.
Let me tell you, race fans, what an exciting day of racing we've had so far. We've we've raced the beaver buggies and we've narrowed it down to the top 10. The top 10 beaver buggies go in no particular order. Malcolm from First Vineland, Seth from First Vineland, Henry from First Beamsville, Cade from First Beamsville, and Dylan from First Beamsville, Sawyer from First North Grimsby, Caitlin P from First North Grimsby, Theo M from First North, Owen S from First North, and lastly, Wesley R from First Vineland. All the beaver buggy round robin has been done. We've raced each car five times. We got one point for finishing first, one, two points for finishing second, and three points for finishing third. Lowest number carries over. These are the top 10 beaver buggies that we have. Now we're gonna race these beaver buggies three times each against three random opponents. We're gonna score them the exact same way, and we are gonna pull the top four beaver buggies out of there. Then those four beaver buggies will race heads up, get a, into a semi-final, and then they will, and that'll determine who the winner of the trophy is for the beaver buggy racing, okay? So we're gonna start right now. The first three, again, they're all gonna be random, are going to be Caitlin Philpott, Theo, and Henry from First Beansville. Cars away. Next heat is Owen S from First North, Sawyer from First North, and Malcolm from uh, First Fine Land. This is Seth from First Fine Land. Wesley from First Wine Land. And Dylan from First Beansville. Beansville, you're the last one to go in the heat because we have an odd ball, we have 10, and we have three races going at once. You're gonna go again. Uh, Caitlin Philpott's gonna go again from First North, and Henry from First is gonna go again. Your top four beaver buggies are Malcolm from First Vineland, Henry from First Beamsville, Dylan from First Beamsville, and Owen S. from First North Grimsby. First race, Henry versus Dylan. Three, two, one, let him go. The final is Owen S from First North against Malcolm from First Vineland. Three, two, one. Guys, here we go. Finals for the Beaver Buggy Racing. It's going to be Owen S from First North Grimsby versus Dylan from First Beamsville. Three, two, one. And now, for the winners of the Beaver Buggy Championship. For best in show, Riker Bonner. And the winner for fastest Beaver Buggy, Owen S. from First North Grimsby. And now, the Beaver Scouters race. Here we go with the Cub Cars. All right, we have 40 Cub Cars here today. Uh, we're gonna start launching the, four, the Cub Cars. We're gonna do it the exact same way we normally do it. We're gonna run the Cub Cars 10 times each. We're gonna score them the exact same way. It's gonna be three Cub Cars going against each other. First place gets one point, second place gets two point, third place gets three points. We're gonna make sure that everybody tries to run a different Cub Car every single time in a different lane so it's always fair. Uh, and then we're gonna we're gonna pick I do believe the top 20 and then we're gonna go we're gonna go from there All right guys, so here we go with the first race three two one
up and busy all day prepping the track for this race day. In these dusty conditions, track prep is key to make sure these cars run straight and true. Your top eight Cub cars, Blaze H, Isaac F, Rowan P, Jacob, Ben K, Isabella R, Ben Gravel, Adriana R. The top four Cub cars are Blaze 8, Rowan P, Ben K, and Adriana R. Lane one, Rowan P from first, Beamsville. And driving out of lane three, Ben K from first, Vineland. And here we have it, the final race. And this year, fastest cup car from first, Vineland, Ben K. And now the cup started race. Let's hear it for the cup scouters. And now the scout drop.
Well, race fans, I haven't been this excited since I heard they were putting chocolate chips in the pancakes at Cup Camp. Let me tell you what a fun day of racing we've had. We've run all the finals and all the cars have been won. It's time for the awards. We're going to start with the Beavers on this side over here. First award is for best design. Best design goes to Riker Bonner from First Beamsville. Let's take a look at this car. Look at that. It's a police officer car. It's an ode to first responders. That's a beautiful looking car. Then Riker, there's your, there's your gold to take home. After a whole day's worth of racing, the winner of the coveted Beaver Buggy Championship Racing Trophy goes to, drum roll please, not a good drummer. It goes to Owen S. from First North. Way to go, Owen. You get to take home the big, the bad Beaver Buggy Trophy. Good job on building your car. It was a fast one. All right, folks. Now the moment everyone's been waiting for. The Cub Cars. Who won them? Who did it? Who worked hard? We're going to start with the best Cub made Cub car. The best Cub made Cub car is a Cub car that is what the judge thinks is all primarily made by the Cub themselves. Best Cub car goes to. Let's get the trophy out first. Here it is, right here. The best Cub car goes to Owen from First Beamsville. Let's take a look at that car. That car looks exactly like the Cub Car box that you get your Cub Car in. It's a beautiful thing, isn't it? Best paint. Best paint job goes to Grant from First North Grimsby. Let's look at this thing. Look at the beautiful camel paint job that he's done. Great job on building that. Next goes to Best Cub Car Design. This was a really tight, tight one to pick from our judge. She said that there are many, many cars that could have made it. But best paint job go, or best design for a cup car goes to one of my personal favorites, the toaster car. This was made by Isaac from First Beamsville. Look at that, he even has an on-off switch. Fantastic, great job and here's your trophy to take home. All right, I'm gonna move these out of the way because now it's time to announce the winners of the 2021 Cub Car Rally. In third place, from First Beamsville Scouting, Adriana Renucci takes home the third place trophy with her hot dog inspired car. Great job, Adriana, good racing today. In second place, also from First Beamsville, this gentleman gets to take home two trophies because we're going over to here and grabbing Rowan car. He takes home second place. What a fantastic, fantastic day he had a racing. And from and from first Vineland, Ben Keir takes home not only his take home first place trophy, he gets to have his name put on the Cub Car Racing Trophy for for now and forever. Great job on all the Cub cars. It was a fantastic day of racing. We'll see you guys next year for the next one. This is Bubbles, signing out.